Hello, you beautiful people, and welcome back to Let's Play Two Point Hospital. Here we are, and on we go. I am about one thing not certain. Do we have enough GP's offices? First things first, guys. I will um, take this GP's office, edit it, and move it over here. We ought to give thanks each day that our humble little county has attracted such giants of industry as Jumbo and some of these new upstarts. It is to these brave companies I dedicate the following song. Um, the, the background, guys, the background, you beautiful people, is why I did do the rearrangement there. I to be honest, have a utter thing for having things aligned out exactly the same anywhere. So I wanted to look it um, to look this the same to make it look the same way. And um, what else do we do? I'll I will move this room if I edit it. I will actually put over here. Okay. That's going to be landing there, fair enough. And then this bench will move over here. And that is it for now, here. Um, I wanted to have another janitor. You, picking you up and you are going to do something there with the ghost so two ghosts are then hopefully gone away that is what I wanted okay we definitely need a bigger ward that is um, send patient home um, yes but uh, just only if our doctor there is trained we're close to award season all right for you um, let's see whether we won a award. I'm not sure. I am really not sure. Oh, two. Best Research Hospital, yes. And we are Employee of the Year. Award for the best employer according to staff happiness and reputation. And the Rising Star awarded for the medical professional who improved the most this year. All right, nice. Um, bum, 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 bum. Again, the DNA room was quite expensive, wasn't it? 50,000, I can't afford that right now. Staff promotion, okay. Um, of course, I would like to have another DNA lab that I can't say otherwise. So I think the situation in our entrance has relaxed and it was good to put the people publicity update. Um, what are Roderick um, Cushion seemed very happy at, as he left our hospital, but then he's an actor. How can one tell? Oh, he sent um, a wad of cash too. I guess that counts. Impressed. We are people from nice hospital. Nice. So we did that. Um, I will, for now, I know it is really expensive, but I'll copy this room. Like so. I know. That may not be the smartest move of me, but I think I need that now. Okay. Doctor to DNA lab. So we have double the patients we can treat. That is the nice part. Um, here, so now I need to send him home. We can actually now take a little look. Um, so we are halfway through. I would like to put the cantina somewhere else. Um, grain water inter intern janitor. Wow, <laughs> there are even janitor interns. All right. Grain Vetter has a request for us. Um, what do you think? I've always wanted to see a large sum of money in person. I don't want to roll around on it or anything. I'm not. The, I'm not weird. Yes, you are. I just want to look at it with my own eyes. Um, challenge: Earn a hundred thousand dollars. I'll accept that. That we already did one time, and it was fair enough. We made it. Um, 
so there's a lot of litter I know I know um, I would I will go for the next hospital space here actually at one point or at this point and I will pull the ward in there to after I have actually um, made a little money again so that is for example um, a thing I would love okay there are two ways all right okay Do you know what? I will now take the cafeteria, um, pause the game, I will edit it and put it right here, uh, make it a little bit bigger. I, to be honest, I really have the feeling that the cafeteria is one thing what I would say is a cash cow. Um, maybe not in this game, which I think is a little sad. Alright. Still only can put in 2x2, two two. that's bad. Can I? Oh, nice. So a little improvement there. That's good for me. Um, cafeterias over here. So I think that would be. <laughs> I'm okay. I think I would put in a toilet over there as well. Do you know what? I'll take. The ward, edit, and I'll move it over here. And to be honest, we make it way bigger. So that's the only reason why I moved it. So let's um, go into editing mode again. One bed over there, one over there. Turn you around. I have. I wanted to, to be honest, I wanted to move the ward for a while. Um, I didn't do it because there were always patient queuing, patients to be on, um, patients queuing up, and I don't didn't want to um, have them move. But for now, I think we have dragged it on too long. So we doubled up with the ward, which of course is very amazing. In bed, um, bed sizes, I just would say. Okay. Um, I want to put in another radiator. Do I need? Uh, well, no. Fair enough. But what well, I'll take over are a. Well, I can actually um, let them their items, benches, one, two. And here I'll maybe put in a toilet. Um, maybe a nice um, use of the space there, wouldn't it? Um, let me actually copy. Mm, okay, that's not working out. That's too bad. But I could pull it over here. Put it, I meant. Over here. If I do something cool here. Which is... Uh, ba -bum -ba -bum. Canceling. Editing the room. Yes. Put in that and... Edit. I'll move the door right. Okay, wait. Pulling that over there. That there. 
and then that is the room is fine again for me I can move this one here and I will copy this toilet I it really is I think that the toilets are sadly enough very very necessary in this game okay that one has to be moved but can be put over there okay then do it that way this one bench um, gone there ain't bad okay we have a way bigger ward which is of course absolutely amazing um, we have a little bit of air down here so I'll technically will um, edit this room and pull it over here can even then think of pulling in some other room is there in <laughs> first of all I pull it like that um, taking the bench over there um, I how I will do, what I will do with the staff room of course I do not now by now okay um, oh we are dead or oh, I know but there will we will be out very very soon I can tell you even with the scan there should be in so much money for us which of course is absolutely amazing for us so it's working good I think um, we need another staff room at some point I'm not sure where I will put it um, our ward is way bigger which is which is absolutely amazing for us I think it really helped out to move all the nurse stuff from here and put it in here um, that helped us out with patients um, re relocating patients and not having one big room which was a problem I always had in the other um, hospitals great part is of course we are in the plus um, okay we did that that is of course very nice Please no ghosts, no ghosts, no ghosts. So there's a lot of people dying. I don't know why. Okay, there, there we have a ghost. That's one of the last things we are going to do right now. Okay, repair that, repair that. Um, okay, let's take him actually. I need you there. All right. Um, I have a very, very, very good feeling. Um, the GP's offices are, well, not as full as before. That's always a, a good thing. This is really a good thing. It is not as full here. The only thing, maybe I should move some rooms here to a, another lot. That is um, what I really need to think about. So I'll... Where is he actually? Okay, he's ghost hunting. That's fair enough, guys. In the end, that brings us already to the end of this episode. Um, we are a little bit away from our goal. And of course, oh, am I? Okay, no, Shock Clinic is still on the way. Although we already have um, cured 10 patients, um, the Shock Clinic is going to be the next room we will address at some point. We will need a radiation as well, which I need to land somewhere as well so guys for that i really thank you for watching if you guys actually have enjoyed this episode then i would um i would be happy if you would subscribe if you haven't subscribed if you have enjoyed this episode as usual give me a thumbs up um and for now i thank you for watching have a nice day stay frosty bye